Hey guys, it's Remington. We just met Lauren, our last bachelorette. So I'm gonna hang out with her for the rest of the day and uh, we're gonna have some fun, ask her some questions and get to know her a little bit. Oh my gosh, are you Lauren from Provo's Most Eligible? Hi Remington, do you wanna come in? Yeah, absolutely. How do you feel now that the world knows you're Provo's Most Eligible Bachelorette? Oh um, I'm excited, I think it'll be, I think it'll be really fun to, to have people watch this season. How was filming? Filming was stressful. Um, there's like a lot of drama and awkward moments and stuff, but overall like 100% so cool. I will never watch The Bachelorette the same way again. What do you think about all the guys? <laughs> Collectively, I feel like all the guys are just so kind, so nice, just awesome dudes. Um, probably the funniest group of guys I've ever met, so they are always keeping me on my toes. They're awesome. What are you doing today? I am going to DI with you. Are you ready to go? Yeah, let's go. All right, let's do it. So Lauren, how old are you? I'm 24. What are you studying? I'm studying marriage and family counseling. How many siblings do you have? Two older sisters. What is your favorite place that you've lived? San Antonio. What's the best date you've ever been on? I had a, okay, I went on a double date where we got snacks and we set up a fort in their apartment because it ended up raining so we had to cancel our plans and we told scary stories. What is your most awkward date? Um, I mean the date itself wasn't that awkward but my first date post-divorce was, um, we went longboarding in a park and it was like fine but i just wasn't super vibing but then afterwards like i was like hey i'm not interested like i was really like just up front i was like i think you're super cool but like i just I'm not super interested he like would not drop it though he just sent me like paragraphs after one day i was just like <laughs> yeah. poor I'm guy probably, probably that. what's his name i'm just kidding <laughs> <laughs> what's the most attractive thing about a guy um i usually say teeth and hair any deal breakers yeah, my biggest deal breaker right now is kind of like, if someone doesn't want to spend as much time with me as I do with them, I feel like that's kind of a deal breaker. Should we do some shopping? Let's do it. The deal, I'm gonna pick out your clothes and you're gonna pick out my clothes okay, to try cool. on. Okay. Ooh, we're gonna find the shortest dresses. I'll find the ugliest clothes I can. Ooh. Yeah, that's not happening. What did you find? Okay, can we find men's clothes, like please, for me to try on? <laughs> What's the most awkward way you've ever been asked out on a date? Uh, mutual. <laughs> when was your first kiss? 11, 11, 11 at 11, 11 in oh, a graveyard. Oh my, in a graveyard? <laughs> That's a story for another time. How many guys have you kissed? Before or after the show? <gasps> Before. Ten. What is your longest boyfriend? Uh, about a year. Hardest breakup? Mm. Last year, I dated this guy for like seven months on and off. It was pretty rough. So you were married, you said? I, I yeah, I was. <gasps> Big reveal. Uh, so how long were you married for? Two and a half years. What was the biggest thing you learned from your divorce? Um, honestly, like, that choosing to love someone is, is real, and, like, it's, it's more about what you do for them than what they do for you. What makes you the happiest? Um, food and attention. Who's your biggest hero? Remington. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Stop, you're flattering me. Uh, any advice to all the people in Provo dating? Uh, it's just so chaotic. Just like, have fun with it. Just enjoy it while you can. We're college kids. Let's live a little. <laughs> Good advice. Have you picked anything out for me yet? It's not bad mm, enough. You can do better. <laughs> Should we model some outfits? Let's do it. Let's do it.
All right, important question. What is your go-to karaoke song? Love on Top, which is in the season, so tune Ooh. in for it. Should we hit it? Yeah. Baby, it's you. You're the one I love. You're the one I need. You're the only one I see. You go talk to your friends, talk to my friends, talk to me. But we skin no one else can feel it for you only you can let it in no one else no one else can speak the words on your lips thanks for letting me tag along today lauren is there anything you have to say to all the fans out there um people about to watch <laughs> so much to say um i just you know we had so much fun with this and no regrets i hope you guys Enjoy it and just have fun with us. No regrets? We'll no see you guys regrets. later. Woo!